वेलकम टू दिस नेक्स्ट सेशन इन ऑटो कैड एल टी इन दिस सेशन वी विल बी डिस्कसिंग द फाइल हैंडलिंग इन ऑटो कैड एज डिस्कस्ड इन द प्रीवियस सेशन द सिस्टम ऑन इट्स ओन असाइन सम फाइल नेम वेन एवर यू स्टार्ट अ न्यू फाइल सो इन दिस केस द फाइल नेम असाइन बाई द सिस्टम इज ड्रॉइंग वन डॉट डी डब्ल्यू जी राइट एंड यू क्रिएट सम एंटिटीज एज पर Uh, your choice let us say you make a circle here and you make a line here and so on right so this is all what that you wanted to create in this file now to save this file if i simply press control s from the keyboard or i simply use this icon save here to save this file then this file will be saved with a default name that is drawing one and it will also be saved at a, a random default location in my system but if i want to specify that i want the file name to be uh, let us say my first drawing and i also want to save it at a particular location and in a particular folder then you can go to this icon here and exercise and use this icon save as within this save as since you are saving a drawing file so click on this icon and now you specify the path where you actually want to store this file for example i want to store this file in documents within document i create a folder because i want to put my drawing files in a particular folder so this folder is created by using this icon so you can name this folder as ut015 that is your course name ut015 underscore let us say your roll number say this is 10190 whatever is your roll number 12112 right so this folder is created double click this folder now within this folder this name name is here within this folder now you can specify say my first drawing right and this is saved okay. now i can check Uh, where i have created this file so i just go to my window explorer go to documents and uh, this is the folder that we just created uta015 and uh, underscore roll number within this this is the file that we have saved so this is the file name right so you have saved your file you have saved your work at a desired location with a desired name now you you want to close this work you you just want to close this file so again for closing the file either you can directly uh, close it from here or you can go to this icon and say close current drawing in case you have multiple drawings open and you want to close all those files in one go you can use this option close all drawings right so i'm just closing this file so this file is now closed right now if i just want to retrieve the same file again maybe next time next week when you come or on the next day when you want to open the same file so that file will be appearing here in the history so you can just double click on this and you can retrieve the same file uh, from the history so the same file opens up uh, other way around you can also retrieve the file using the open file command so this was it this this icon is for starting the new file similarly this icon now will be using for opening an existing file so this open file icon is present here also open file is present here also right so whatever uh, way you like so you can now open the existing file click on this icon and uh, then you can browse the path wherever is your file like we saved it in documents documents and this was the folder uta015 underscore row number click on this and this is the file name that i want to retrieve so select the file and say open so the file comes up right now let us say i just want to uh, make some changes in this drawing say i just want to add one more circle so i just place one more circle now this updated file has to be uh, saved again with the same file name now i can simply use this icon this is saved icon or i can also use save icon from this drop down or i can simply press control s from the keyboard so once you save it uh, then uh, the same file in the uh, document folder gets saved 
but now you can see if I just go to my window browser here you see now in the same folder I have got not one but two files this is the one which is which has been just uh, recently updated where we added one more circle now I can close this file I have just updated it and saved it so closed it now uh, this is the updated file which has got two circles right you can see in the preview also that there are two circles in this file but what is this new file this new file is the backup file so this is the function of AutoCAD application that whenever you save an existing file it always retains the previous version of that file so in case you lose this updated file somehow you delete this file or in case you just want to roll back the last changes that you made in the last session so you can always recall the previous session by using this backup file right but if you are happy with the with the updated version then you, later on you can always delete this it will not uh, create any problem so this file is the one which has been updated and saved so if you double click on this you will again reach the AutoCAD application and the same file will be opened up so that is how uh, the file handling in AutoCAD is done in the next session we will be discussing about the basic drawing tools uh, for creating the geometrical entities in AutoCAD thank you for watching this video